Hello, this is Gerald from the Pyro CMS development team. This screencast will show you how to install Pyro CMS. We're here at pyrocms.com and we're going to download the latest release, which at the time of this screencast is 1.0.1. .1. Okay, we have the download and now we need to copy it onto the server and name it something simple. We'll go with Pyro CMS, all lowercase. Now let's go back and navigate to the installer. Just type your basic path. And now we need to fill out the database and server information. Server is probably going to be localhost and fill out the database username, password, and I would recommend to install it without mod rewrite for the first time unless you're absolutely certain that your server mod rewrite is operating properly. Let's check all the requirements and everything checks out good except for curl and that's fine on this server. I don't have curl enabled. Let's go on to the next step. Let's check the permissions. It looks like everything is okay except for the config file. Copy this command and let's head over and open the terminal to run that command. Change to the directory that pyrocms is in and paste that command and run it. Let's go back and check it again and now it's writable. We're good to go. On to the next step. Name your database which I named it video. Create it automatically and create your user account. This will be the main administrator. Okay, let's install it. And there we go. It installed successfully. Let's go to the control panel. Log in with the email and password that you just set up for the administrator. and there is the control panel. Let's check out the front end. There it is, default theme, and that's all there is to it. We now have Pyro CMS up and running, and we're ready to add content. 